level and we just uh, sat outside the um, village clock tower is quite well known for um, waves crashing over it. it's my last picture of this year over there and I am um, I am just going to Halfway in, but it's uh, it's the date today. It's July 26th, uh, and it uh, says extreme danger, danger of deaths in great seas. Here's close when red ball is raised. Well, at the moment. Um, See quite a bit of waves crashing, quite a rough turbulent sea at the moment. But near high tide, with this kind of wind, there would be breaking waves. But you don't really want to be on here as the waves really crash and sometimes do crash against the wall of the clock tower. Uh, of the Port Eleven, it's a famous place for crashing waves and storms. Uh, a little less rain now, it was just it's raining a bit when I got out of the car. As you can see, there is a little bit of wave crashing coming onto the pier. The, um, the uh, harbour wall here, but it's still safe. But, you know, the lights they still regard this as okay. And you see the rest of Cornwall, um, a lot, and uh, kind of. Yeah, this is. I had to get splashed. <laughs> Here's a wave. <laughs> You've got to be crazy if you want to jump in this water. This is probably one of the most turbulent water in all of Britain. I'm just checking my pockets, it's got the essentials on my car keys. I'm going to run out of my boots, or else I can't get back in the car again. Well, there's a little bit of it. Depends on big waves. This is normally out of bounds to pay people when the seas are very rough. I mean, you can tell that this is, this is probably something that's like starting up. If somebody fell in here, like a vulnerable person, there would just be no chance of, of getting out and being hit by the turbulent seas. So this is why you would never want to fall. Sometimes the, some waves are bigger, 
that if, as the tide cuts in, some of the waves get so big, they'll just crash over here. Probably worse, you probably find that you can't really do it and part of the wall. But as you see, it's still, still green and still seems okay to walk. So that's, that's a, a recap of um, Port Levin, just a uh, nice wavy scene of cheap waves. Summer, right? It feels like the winter this time of week. See what really the wind goes in cool mood during during this uh, monstrosity of heat waves as we go on across mid Europe. 